Marshall Rosenbluth received his doctorate in physics from the University of Chicago at the age of 22. For the next four decades, he would dominate the world of fusion theory, mimicking the sun's energy here on Earth. At Los Alamos National Laboratory, Rosenbluth first figured in the early development of the hydrogen bomb. Soon, he was transferred to the then-classified Project Sherwood. Its mission? To create controlled thermonuclear fusion as an unlimited source of energy. To accomplish this feat, fuel or plasma must remain hot enough for long enough to be self-sustaining, like the sun. Rosenbluth pioneered the understanding of instabilities faced at one billion degrees. His innovative and collaborative work in the 1970s was instrumental in the success of experiments conducted two decades later at Princeton University's Plasma Physics Laboratory. Today, Rosenbluth is involved in the physics design of the International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor, or ITER, a proposed large-scale international experiment to test the feasibility of fusion reactors. Marshall Rosenbluth has been described as a great classical physicist, a pure scientist, and a statesman. Long before Glasnost, he was leading the way in international scientific collaborations.